In this video, we're going to take a closer look at modeling by face based on the conceptual massing model that we have imported from the massing family editor. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come up here to my massing insight tab and you'll see my model by face panel. This is the panel we're going to be dealing with here in this video. I'm going to rotate my massing just so that I can begin from this axon perspective and I'm going to come in and the first thing I want to do is I want to add the floors to my project. I'm going to click on that. Because I want the ground floor to actually be this generic 12 inch and I want the floors above grade to be a different floor type, I'm going to select just that ground mass floor. Make sure generic 12 inch is selected and I'm going to go ahead and click create floor. Now I have a 12 inch at the ground floor. Now I'm going to select all of my mass floors above grade and I want to make sure all of these are actually converted so let's go back to this massing panel click by floor and I'm going to begin to select all my floors above grade so that I can convert all of these mass floors into a three inch lightweight concrete on two inch metal deck type floor. So I'm going to make sure that selected it from the properties menu. I'm going to click back on my paste, place by floor and I'm going to click create floor. Now I have model by face all the floors. For the glazing that we're going to put in, we're actually going to come back to this massing tab and we're going to use the curtain system. Initially you'll use curtain system a lot of times to lay out the the glazing areas and your conceptual massing. So let's do that. I'm going to tab through and select the faces that I need. I'll hit create system. Just hit create system for these faces and let's just rotate it so that we can go ahead and create a window system for the other side. that just about captures them. Let's hit create system again. Let's come back up here. Wall by face. And we're going to make sure we're using an exterior brick on metal stud wall. Let's just use our view cube, rotate this a little bit, make sure that we have assigned some type of material to each of our exterior faces. And I think that just about captures it. We have one more thing. Let's make sure that we come in here and use our roof model by face tool. And we're going to use this steel truss insulation on metal deck type 
I'm going to select the roof of my spine. And each of these units. And hit create roof. Now we have applied some materiality to each of the faces. I hope this video has been helpful.